Andraste, how much did you expend to discover me? It must have weakened the Inquisition immeasurably. I don't know who you are. You don't fool me. I'm too important for this to be an accident. My efforts will survive in victories against you elsewhere. Just say what? What is the... Squishy one, but you heard me, right? Just say what? Rich tits always try for more than they deserve. Blah, blah, blah! Obey me, arrow in my face. So, you followed the notes well enough. Glad to see you're... You're kind of plain, really. All that talk, and then you're just... a person. I mean, it's all good, isn't it? The important thing is, you glow. You're the herald thingy. Some believe I'm the Herald of Andraste. But who are you, and what's this about? No idea. I don't know this idiot from manners. My people just said the Inquisition should look at him. Your people? Elves? 
<laughs> no. People, people. Name's Sarah. This is cover. Get round it. For the reinforcements. Don't worry. Someone tipped me their equipment shed. They've got no breaches. Friends really came through with that tip. No breaches. <laughs> so, Herald of Andraste, you're a strange one. I'd like to join.
How about we get to know each other first? You know, names and such. One name. No, wait, two. It's... Well, it's like this. I sent you a note to look for hidden stuff by my friends. The friends of Red Jenny. That's me. Well, I'm one. So is a fence in Montfort, some woman in Kirkwall. There were three in Starkhaven, brothers or something. It's just a name, yeah? It lets little people, friends, be part of something while they stick it to nobles they hate. So here, in your face, I'm Sarah. The friends of Red Jenny are sort of out there. I use them to help you. Plus arrows. The Inquisition has spies already. Can you add to these professionals? Here's how it is. You important people are up here, shoving your cods around. Blah, blah, I'll crush you, I'll crush you. Mm -hmm. Ooh, crush you. <clears throat> then you've got cloaks and spy kings, like this tit. Or was he one of the little knives, all serious with his little knife? All those secrets, and what gave him up? 
some houseboy who don't know shite, but knows a bad person when he sees one. So no, I'm not knifey shiv dark, all hidden. But if you don't listen down here too, you risk your breaches. Like those guards? I stole their... Look, do you need people or not? I want to get everything back to normal. Like you. Back there you wanted to know if I glow. Why? That's what you do, innit? True or not, it seemed like the easiest way to know it was you. Well, that's what they say on all. Look, don't get ahead yet. I want to help this. Bad things should happen to bad people. We find someone not so bad, maybe he'll end up not so dead. Good enough? And someone has to have explained to them that free help is good. All right, Sarah. I can use you and your friends. Yes! Getting good before you're too big to like. That'll keep your breaches where they should be. Plus extra breaches because I have all these... You have merchants who buy that piss, yeah? Got to be worth something. Anyway, Haven. See you there, Herald. This will be grand. Lord Trevelyan of Ostwick, representing the Inquisition. A pleasure, sir. We so rarely have a chance to meet anyone new. It is always the same crowd at these parties. So you must be a guest of Madame de Fer, or are you here for Duc Bastien? Are you here on business? I have heard the most curious tales of you. I cannot imagine half of them are true.
tearing up the dales in a foolish bid. Some say that when the ve- I've heard she finds it amusing. So but- Everyone knows it's just an excuse for a bunch of political outcasts to grab power. I was chosen by Andraste herself to carry out the mission. You dare to speak of the Maker's will? With... We know what your ink was. If you were a man of honor, you'd step... My dear Marquis, how unkind of you to use such language in my house to my guests. You know such rudeness is intolerable. Uh, Madame Vivienne, I humbly beg your pardon. You should. Whatever am I going to do with you, my dear? My lord, you're the wounded party in this unfortunate affair. What would you have me do with this foolish, foolish man? I think the Marquis has seen the error of his ways. By the grace of Andraste, you have your life, my dear. Do be more careful with it. <laughs> I'm delighted you could attend this little gathering. I've so wanted to meet you. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Vivienne, first enchanter of Montsimard and enchantress to the Imperial Court. Is that Marquis going to pose a problem? His aunt is the Vicomtesse of Mont de Glace, not a powerful. Alphonse will be disowned for this. It's not the first time he's brought his aunt disgrace. And after such a public humiliation, I expect he'll run off to the Dales to join, either to make a good end or to win back a modicum of self-respect. Charmed, Lady Vivian. Ah, but I didn't invite you to the Chateau for pleasantries. With Divine Justinia dead, the Chantry's in shambles. Only the Inquisition might restore sanity and order to our frightened people. As the leader of the last loyal mages of Thedas, I feel it only right that I lend my assistance to your cause. What exactly can you do for the Inquisition? I am well versed in the politics of the Orlesian Empire. I know every member of the Imperial Court personally. I have all the resources remaining to the Circle at my disposal. And I'm a mage of no small talent. Will that do? Is your interest in the Inquisition, Madame de Fer, or is it more personal? <laughs> Aren't you charming? <laughs> it's professional, of course. The Inquisition will be happy to have you, Lady Vivian. Great things are beginning, my dear. I can promise you that. Creator, judge me hard. Find me well within your grace.
in peace. It's good you've returned. We heard of your encounter. You heard? My agents in a city sent word ahead, of course. It's a shame the Templars have abandoned their senses, as well as the capital. At least we know how to approach the mages and Templars now. Do we? Lord Seeker Lucius is not the man I remember. True, he has taken the order somewhere, but to do what? My reports have been very odd. We must look into it. I'm certain not everyone in the order will support the Lord Seeker. Or the Herald could simply go to meet the mages in Redcliffe instead. You think the Mage Rebellion is more united? It could be ten times worse. I could at least find out what the mages want. No doubt what they've always wanted. Support for their cause. We shouldn't discount Redcliffe. The mages may be worth the risk. They are powerful, Ambassador, but more desperate than you realize. After the Divine's death, they're probably scrambling for allies. If some among the rebel mages were responsible for what happened at the Conclave, the same could be said about the Templars. True enough. Right now, I'm not certain we have enough influence to approach the Order safely. Then the Inquisition needs agents in more places. That's something you can help with. In the meantime, we should consider other options. There is one other matter. Several months ago, the Grey Wardens of Ferelden vanished. I sent word to those in Orlais. Ordinarily, I wouldn't even consider the idea they're involved in all this, but the timing is... Grey War... They're an ancient order that has existed to fight Darkspawn invasions since the first... They have faded since those glory days. Ordinarily, their order is neutral in political affairs, but they appear in strange places. That does sound odd, I agree. The others have disregarded my suspicion. Two days ago, my agents in the hinterlands heard news of a... If you have the opportunity, please... And if you can't? Then there may be more going on than we thought. Please tell me this might sound... Can I help you with something? I'll speak with you later. Travel safely. Good day to you. What do the people make of us? Despite our fame, we're low on steadfast allies. We must aim for more. Any visit? Sir Griffith of Denerim. He's defeated dark spawns. Just don't ask. I met an elven mage earlier. Solus, I believe he was called. I admit I was surprised. I did. Tell me, why were you at the Divine Conclave? The Circle had plenty of problems, but it's an institution we sorely need. I wish more people understood the truth of this. Justinia's death has shattered the balance of power in Thedas. If it is not restored quickly, countless lives will be lost. Mages, Templars, innocent people of all kinds now look to the Inquisition to decide their fate. I'll try not to let them down. Failure is a luxury we cannot afford. For almost a thousand years, the... 
And now many believe you are the agent of his will. Whatever the truth is, that belief gives you power. If that's true, then I'll put it... I suppose we... I've stolen enough of your time. Yes? Is there anything I can do to help your efforts at restoring the Circle? After the Circle's... a thousand... I've received news that some tomes have been located, if you are interested in righting this wrong. I'll look into it for you. If you can take care of this matter, the Circle would be in your debt. Excuse me. I've got a message for the Inquisition, but I'm having a hard time getting anyone to talk to me. Who are you, soldier? Comissius Aklasi with the Bulls Chargers Mercenary Company. We mostly work out of Orle and Navarra. We've got word of some Divinta mercenaries gathering out on the Storm Coast. My company commander, Iron Bull, offers the information free of charge. If you'd like to see what the Bulls Chargers can do for the Inquisition, meet us there and watch us work. Why did your commander send us this information? Iron Bull wants to work for the Inquisition. He thinks you're doing good work. I look forward to meeting this Iron Bull. We're the best you'll find. Come to the Storm Coast and you can see us in action. You return. Can you tell me about the original Inquisition? The original... Instead of hunting those who would do harm, the Inquisitors spread the chant of light by force. It sounds as though it was necessary at the time. Perhaps. There was no... In any case, the Inquisitors became the seekers of truth, and eventually the Templars. And now the Inquisition has been called again... Do you know what impresses me most of... They fought horrific battles, killed and died for their cause. Perhaps the name was divine, Justinia's mess, but when its work is done, it will put its sword away. It may not seem like much, but it would enable my healers to save many lives. Farewell. Farewell. Apothecary Adon wanted to know when you might be able to provide the materials he needs. 